Sir, aren't you? What? You mean that giant mouse? No way. That's the rat. He looks like a final boss. <sighs> yeah, not possible. What kind of magic would you have to use to turn this rat into that monster? Oh, could it be because he was friend zoned? Uh, of course not. But whatever it is, I didn't expect Bisha to be the first to rush over here. When did she get over her intense fear of monsters? I bet she saw the children being attacked and shook off her trauma just like a real hero would. Let's go back her up. Newcomers? Whoa, that was pretty rough. Hey, Bisha, I'm not the enemy. Lady Neptune, don't get careless and don't get too close to her. Huh? It seems Sir Warichu isn't the only one acting strange. W what do you mean? What? More newcomers? I'll turn any monsters in front of me into meat chunks! <laughs> Don't run away! I'm gonna kill all the monsters! Kill them! Kill them! Yikes! She's gone completely bonkers! Her change is crazier than blondes. Judging by her behavior, it's possible she views us all as enemy monsters. And this may not be limited to us. Does that mean she could look at anybody and think they're a meanie monster? Most likely. If that's the case, this is gonna be troublesome. It'd be fine if Bisha was just fighting the rat. But if we get in the middle of them, both of them might direct their attacks towards us. Right. We'll need to separate them somehow. But what would we do afterwards? If we don't know what's causing them to do this, then we won't be able to treat either of them. Hmm, maybe it has something to do with Bisha's fear of monsters, but it's hard to imagine that she'd take it this far. It's all because of that girl! Chuko? It's too dangerous for you to be out here! Do you know how those two ended up like this? That girl had come chasing after Warichu! Who are you? That's not important. I'm here to help you overcome your fear of monsters. Although, you might find my methods extreme. Huh? What do you mean? Let's see. Why don't we start with you, Mr. Adorable Little Mouse? What? Are you scared? Uh, uh-huh. But if you were to run away, the city would end up in quite a terrible predicament, wouldn't it? Are you okay with that happening? Uh, I know. I really do, but my legs, my whole body's shaking. I see. What you need is a little more motivation. A novel way to recall an event, flashing back in time and showing us what happened instead of merely summarizing it. A mysterious girl that came up during the story bothers me. I wonder who she is. Besides, even if we know what's causing it, what do we do? That's easy. We'll just fight both of them and knock them both unconscious. right now in order to minimize damage to the city and its citizens they both need to be subdued 
If taking them down doesn't change them, they'll at least be out cold and we can figure out what our next move should be. Understood. And allow me to draw Sir Warichu away. In the meantime, you and the others can take care of the other one. All right. This is a bit of a tough opponent for you to fight, but you're fine, right, Nep? I'm aware, and yes, I'm ready to go. Besides, I'm sure she didn't wish this upon herself either. It's the duty of a friend to stop her. What? Even though you're just an ignorant monster, you actually want to fight? Isha. I'm gonna show you that you're nothing but meat chunks when you try to stand against me! I'll show you the power Who's of the Planetune CPU! Here we go! I'm grateful. Who's my opponent? to me. My opponent. Let's end this here with Neptune Break. I'll return twice the fate. Oh! Not bad. 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 Not bad.
Step yet again. Nice. I did it. But I'll try even harder from now. As expected of Gold Third. You're not bad yourself for a monster. Bisha, please come to your senses. Can you not see? Look at our planet tune. Look at all of the terrified children fleeing. Children? If you think a monster can deceive me, you've got another thing coming. Everyone here's a monster. Monsters are enemies of the children. Their enemies are my enemies, so all of them have to die. Why won't my voice reach you? Uh. Steamax? R regrets. This is bad. The rat's headed towards the city. Ah! It's a monster! Help me! Mommy! What can I do in this situation? Uh, these voices! Nep Nep, Bisha's acting differently. Is she reacting to the children's voices? Listen, Bisha. Everyone is scared of monsters. Even I'm scared of them. But you don't have to force yourself to overcome your fears. I know you have the courage to accept them instead. Accept my fears? I see. It's all right if I'm afraid. Yes. If you don't know fear, then you can't be a hero. Now that Beesh has come to her senses, all that's left is that rat monster. Then let's hurry. Bisha, are you all right in that state? Please don't push yourself. Even if it's pushing myself, I can't rest. This is exactly the time when a hero needs to appear. <laughs> <laughs> 